Peak travel season is around the corner. Now that the CDC has given the green light to those who've been fully vaccinated, the urge for a getaway is also on the rise. Recently, TSA reported a 890% jump in checkpoint travel numbers compared to the same time last year. But there are a few things you should know before planning your trip. I just want us to be mindful as we actually get back into the airport and start thinking about what we need to do to stay healthy. Dr. Ken Redcross is a board-certified internal medicine physician. He says it's important to have a plan in place. I know we all want to get back to normal life, but if we're going to go to that airport, let's make sure we're doing three things. Number one, that mask, incredibly important, and that's the basis for everything. Two, wash hands, and three, practice social distancing and avoid large crowds. Dr. Red Cross also advises to err on the side of caution and try to avoid international travel unless you really have to. While fully vaccinated travelers are less likely to get and spread COVID-19, the spread of variants differ from country to country. I think we need to wait a few months, everyone, because we've learned what the variants can do. They increase the infection rate, which is a big deal, and they also increase mortality or death. So let's figure a little bit about what's going on. Let's get our hands around the situation in India a little bit. Also, do your homework and find out your destination's requirements. Travel expert Robert Fierpro Capaiello says one of the best ways to stay safe is by taking advantage of technology. We're going to find that many, many properties now offer the opportunity for contactless transactions, bookings, payments, mobile check-in. It's artificial intelligence, but it's so good that it's giving you local recommendations and tips for the property. And along with packing essentials for your getaway, don't forget these items to give your immune system a boost. Vitamin D should be on the top of your list. And then there's omega-3, there's magnesium, there's a lot of other things that have a beautiful interplay to help balance our immune system. And that's the name of the game, especially now. For domestic travel, the CDC says fully vaccinated travelers don't have to get tested before or after travel. They also don't have to self-quarantine unless their destination requires it. If you develop symptoms, isolate and get tested. For international travelers, while you don't need to self-quarantine after arriving in the United States, the agency does recommend recommend getting tested three to five days after travel. Stacey Ann Gooden, PIX11 News.